And welcome back to the channel, guys. It is time to watch something rated JG with me, John G and Ricky. I'm hey, we got uh, Macy Williams uh, playing Arya Stark, uh, her remembering her role and uh, kind of going back in time and talking about all the great parts of her doing Game of Thrones since it is the final season. Let's see what Macy's got to say. I mean, she's she's one of the best characters to do it. One of the most fan favorites. Let's do it. Ooh, I like that. I've thrown everything into Arya. Every tool I've got as an actor, I've used in Arya. As it's really actress. hard to create new people now. Every time I do it, it's just a little bit worse. Like, don't do it quite as good as Arya. Don't make them quite as strong or quite as cool as Arya. Well, that's a heist. I'm 100% gonna miss that. I'm still not done with, like, mourning her. I, we can't talk about that. I'm gonna cry. <laughs> Wait, mourning who? I was quite young and I had such a big imagination. In those scenes when I was younger, I would really convince myself that I was there and it was happening, you know? That was the only really way that I knew how to act, just by really living that sort of moment. It was just a really pinnacle point in my life. Macy did a great job. It's like school to me. It's really shaped me as a person. In school, you learn equations and you learn spelling and you learn maths, physics. Uh, but then when you leave school, you go out into the big wide world and you learn about yourself and you learn about people and you learn about how you connect and communicate. I'm so confident. I've just got this confidence from the show and from playing Aria. I really feel like I just want to inject that into each and every person that I know and love, but then also any girl that admires the work that I do. I want to let everyone sort of feel that sort of confidence that I've been lucky to feel because of this show. Who taught you that shite? The greatest the girl from the world. shite. Syria Pharrell. The greatest swordsman lost to Marin Tran. The nature of our scenes have just been really, really great fun to work through. You're afraid of fire. Do you look like a scared little girl? It was just such a strange dynamic that we had, but it was a lot of fun. Oh yeah, yeah, they they paired so well together. I remember, it's being really late, being tired, but also being like having a good time. I was flicking pigeon pie at Sophie. That was my first day on set. Yeah. Ha. She's a Kobe. Saying, can you just like try and get it like right on her cheek? And I just remember thinking like, you want me to actually aim it? Like, can't you do this? Is the movies? Can't you make it happen? My favorite bit. Probably. Oh, they didn't have the budget back Tricky then. <laughs> I remember thinking, oh, no, maybe they're gonna fire me because I can't get it right. But they didn't. I'm still here, decade later. <laughs> it was really great fun. Honestly, the most fun I had was working with Sophie. When we did that scene nice. when Arya's reeling Sansa and Sansa's oh, like, yeah, that's what training, she was saying too. slagging each other and like really going at each other. That day on set, I, I was never laughed so much in my life. It was so much fun. It was a day with the wheelchair. I've still got that video, jeez. Me and Sophie just messing around on um, Brad's wheelchair. <laughs> we were just going mental. We get on really well in real life, so it's really What's annoying when we have to go and then sort of I'm being a bit horrible to her and she's being a bit rude. She's just my best friend. I mean, like, who else gets to go to work with their best friend? When it's all said and done, I'll miss the dynamic of the show, because there's nothing like this show. I was very, very lucky to meet the people that I met and to work with the people that I've worked with. And I, I truly believe on the show that the stars just aligned and it just made magic. I think it's <laughs> rare to find a group of people that work together so well and care about each other so much. It's been a really safe place for me to mess around and figure out how to be an actor. If I do nothing else, I'll be happy. I'm going to miss this show so much. They've written this incredible season for us to wrap up Game of Thrones, but now we've got to go and actually shoot it. I'm lucky that I play Arya and no scene is ever boring. Now we've got to just finish it off the last few little pages. And it's all over. Perfect. 
<clears throat> excuse me but hey aria is wow macy williams one of the most iconic roles they did a great cast when it comes to all the characters in game of thrones but there are a few that stick out there's uh Tyrion sticks out uh of course sean penn playing ned sticks out um the hound sticks out sam sticks out uh macy sticks out uh there's there's about several characters that stick out daenerys sticks out there's there's several several characters you know while it had a great casting there's the few that are just up there in that upper echelon so and macy's one of them so macy hey great job uh an amazing learning experience i'm sure for you doing game of thrones for a decade and uh, i want to say thank you for all your hard work in making this show uh what it is because honestly it wouldn't be uh as good as it is uh without you and without your role so i want to say thank you to that and hey guys let me know what you thought about that uh serial pharrell is he the greatest swordsman of all time let me know in the comments below and uh hey i do these reaction reviews i'm gonna be doing a ton of game of thrones stuff season eight is almost here so subscribe to that channel if you want to see more thrones from me have a good one take care Thank you.